Vaughan, a three-one victory tonight against Concept. Uh, firstly, what were you, what did you make of the performance? I thought first half we were a bit sloppy and giving forcing too many balls forward instead of keeping it. So I just put ten behind ball and made it hard work. But second half we've come out and we've moved the ball a lot quicker and put it in better areas and got in and scored as goals. How frustrating was that that opening sort of seventy minutes before the game changed? It's always frustrating when balls are going astray, even myself with the passes one coming off but we kept kept going and stuck together and didn't change the game plan, just stuck to it and luckily it's come off. Obviously you got the, the goal to, to get us back into it. Just describe what we're going through your uh, through your eyes at that point. I'm, I'm always in and around the box and now this foul me and luckily I have got on the end of it and scored to be fair. Obviously now you've got three and three. Uh, now once you got that first goal, do you feel like you've you've got a different confidence in yourself? I just want to be playing as much as I can. The more games I play, I think the better I'll get, especially with this bunch of lads and great great players. And once we did get that goal, obviously it was it was a quick turnaround to get the second. Um, did you feel that once we did get that first goal, we'd go on to score another two? Yeah, definitely. The first goal's massive, and I thought we could have been four 0 up at half time. I've had one disallowed. Uses it the bar. We've had a, few, a penalty shout, which I, I believe is a pen on Josh with an elbow. Then we won in second half too, which definite pen. But we stuck to his game plan and it's come off. And in the end, do you feel like we were we were a good value for the win? Definitely, we move the ball well. And they haven't really had a sniff. Really, it's just the got their goals came from our free kick and sloppiness. And it was not good enough from our part, but we understand that as a group and. We've reacted well, so we kick on. If this sort of type of game was was last season, um, what you could argue maybe we want to come away with three points. What do you feel like has changed within the squad um, and a different sort of resilience in that? Just there's a lot more leaders, I believe, and just the quality on the ball and just when to go forward, when to keep it and go side to side. Just that's it, really. And as we mentioned, you're back in the goals. How are you feeling? I'm buzzing, really. It's about time, and I just want to kick on now and score as many as I can. Obviously, now we've got that that run of games. Sort of, a lot of squads will be thinking about fatigue, but due to how good our squad in depth is at times, and how we yeah. rotate and stay just as strong, are you sort of looking forward to the next month? <laughs> Definitely, but I, like I said, I, I feel fit, and I want to play as many games as I can. I want to play every game, but obviously with the quality we've got here, it's hard. But hopefully, I can keep taking my chances and give the gaffer an headache. And I suppose you're benefiting from those around as well. Obviously, either operating either third forward or deeper in midfield, having you know when you when you are in that midfield, yeah. having either Terry, Wedge, Greeny in there, or up front you've got Hanson, Hardy, and, yeah. and Hughes. What what's it like for yourself around it's, these players? They just make me a better player, really. The, the experience, constantly talking to me, even when we're in changing room beforehand, and just helping me through it. And even like when it, if I have a good game, just a little compliment and means a lot to me. And I'll only get better with them around me. And obviously yourself, after you know, sort of coming into men's football from a from a very young age, yeah. you, you've sort of been around this scene with, with Pontian Liversidge for a couple of years. Yeah. Does it feel strange that you're still you know, learning and benefiting off these type of players? Definitely, I think as a footballer you're always learning, even they may learn a little off us, even different things, but I'm, I'm here to learn and just want to improve myself and hopefully I can do it here with Worksop. Moving on to Saturday's game, uh, obviously Brunswick Borough haven't had the best of starts, but how important is it to go into that with the, the same professional attitude that we've got? We've just got to take each game as it comes and approach it like no other. And it'll be a massive task ahead, but we're here to take it and we want to kick on now and go on another unbeaten run.